I'm uh, Stefan Long, Professor of Vascular Surgery. I work at the Lille University Centre, which is uh, the largest academic centre in France. We have uh, 3,500 beds here. Uh, it's a tertiary referral centre, uh, working 24-7. I'm head of uh, the Arctic Center, uh, working with uh, cardiovascular surgeons, vascular surgeons, cardiologists, and interventional radiologists. We performed a lot of uh, complex aortic repairs, uh, especially since we've installed the IGS 730 hybrid room in our unit. We now have access to uh, the best of the uh, imaging applications in the OR in, the, in a secure environment. We can perform open repair and endovascular repairs using everyday uh, advanced imaging applications such as Fusion, such as Condium CT, and more recently uh, we have access to EVAR Assist, which is a, a new imaging application helping us to design the endograft and also to prepare the, the procedure. What's uh, very specific and very nice uh, about uh, EVAR Assist is that it's available on the AW server. Uh, so obviously we have access to the 3D workstation in the hybrid room, but also from uh, my office or uh, from uh, the meeting room. So we can actually all meet together, uh, design the endograph together. By focusing on the 3D imaging, you can design the endograph, but also uh, prepare the best uh, working position for the gantry and the table during the case. And we're actually going to record uh, those working positions and call them back uh, in, in the OR when performing the case from table side. So this is very useful because all the time spent designing the endograph is used to prepare uh, the procedure. What's also very interesting about the new uh, uh, Fusion software is uh, the by view mode. Uh, what we do is uh, we register one fluoroscopy image and then another one with a very uh, different angulation and we have both views that are together on the large display monitor and we can then register uh, the pre-op CT image on top of the fluoro image uh, using translation and rotation looking at both fluoroscopic views. So that's uh, very fast, very user friendly and actually very accurate. Once the endograft has been advanced over stiff wire we can very easily do a dynamic registration and then become very accurate. So the most interesting part is that the registration takes just a couple of minutes and then uh, throughout the procedure, when you need it, you can fine-tune it uh, to, to make it 100% accurate. And I think chronic dissections is the best example because uh, we are all, always concerned about uh, working in the true or the false lumen. And now by actually preparing a fusion mask uh, one with the true lumen, one with the false lumen. We can switch from one to the other uh, during the case and always know where we are. So it's a very secure way of doing those challenging cases and um, uh, we are very happy uh, to, to be able to use them routinely.